All right, V2 is a nightmare. Things are flubbed, and I have literally no assets for the stream. I'm Killer Man Time, and you are here watching Squad Ops One Life Events Operation Enforcer. Hopefully, that is the correct title that I put for the stream. It does look like it's cool. It did update. Um, sadly, all my overlay stuff is not correct, so. I done flubbed that, and I will be removing that later. Um, hope y'all have been doing good. I'm going to go ahead and get straight into it, because nothing I have here is going to be correct, except for the command, and uh, <laughs> you'll see what I had to do for the loadouts. All right, so round one commands tonight uh, for the Canadian forces. We have for command, Lawn Darts, 2IC being Rose Dragon. Four other SLs being Raggy, Krusty, Razor, Fulcrum. And for the Russians, command's going to be Sloth, with his 2IC being Paladin. And his four other SLs being Dwarf, Revy, Frost, and Oddball. Moving over to the loadouts. Oh boy, the loadouts. Oh, look at that fantastic, fantastic loadouts. Oh boy. Okay. So. First off, we've got the Canadians. For the infantry, we have five squads, one SL, two FTLs, um, riflemen's, and one medic with a platoon armory, uh, exclamation mark there, no, asterisk, whatever. Uh, we've got eight ARs, eight LATs, two HATs, two MGs, three medics, and crewmen as needed. No vehicles, no fob logistics, no support. Moving on. Now we're going to talk about the Canadians. Or not the Canadians, the Russians. And for the Russians tonight, we've got infantry wise squad, one SL, two FTLs, riflemen's, two ARs, and one medic. No uh, uh, platoon loadouts. We've got for vehicles, three Logi trucks with 1,000 each. Uh, for build and ammo. And we've got one trans truck. Fob and logistics consist of defensive positions, one fob, and sandbags only. And support, none. Woo. Fantastic. Alright guys, listen up. Welcome to version 2 of Squad, Operation Enforcer on our nice new map. Just discussing with the leadership how much experience we have playing this map. You'll, you'll be good to know combined. We have about uh, four minutes experience playing this map. <laughs> Lol. So, uh, uh, to give us, if you walk you into uh, large snow open fields, uh, the only way we're going to get out of that is to uh, use overwhelming fire and suppress the enemy. We have a lot of uh, ARs, LATs, etc. So, if we do come across a Russian position, let's just light the hell out of it up and encourage them to fall back to the uh, final destination that we're all going for, which is in Golf 12, Golf 13 area. But before that, we're going to be moving uh, out of live in a uh, platoon column, heading north, uh, checking our first objective in Lima 12. Uh, it's possible that Russian forces can have advanced uh, outposts, so uh, expect contact almost as soon as we get out of main protection. Does everyone uh, remember that? Once we clear out Lima 12, We'll then be uh, swinging uh, west northwest, and uh, our next target will be shipping centre to uh, get in there and clear that out. Once that's clear, we'll probably spread out a little bit more in a platoon line, start walking it west through the India and Hotel columns until we get to our objective, uh, Golf 12, Golf 13. We're looking for a Russian fob radio. We're looking to destroy that and kill all the Russians we find. Uh, there is a big uh, hangar style building that I've put the fob marker on. Golf 1275. Uh, if I was on the Russian team, I think that's where I would put it. There is a uh, sniper mark. There is a large tower that overlooks the entire town in Foxtrot 12. So uh, ARs, make sure you're keeping an eye on the uh, windows up there. Uh, fire team leads, make sure you're using your binoculars with your ARs to direct their fire to make sure if anyone's in that building, you keep their heads down. Because there's a lot of open ground around that town that we'll have to cross. And the only way we're going to do it is having a squad being a base of fire and a squad moving under that fire. Once we clear out all the Russians in Golf 12 and Golf 13, we'll then uh, secure the area and await further orders from headquarters. Any questions? 
What's the expected mortality rate for this mission? Pretty high. Uh, if we get a squad in the open and a Russian AR or two looking at us as we cross this snow, as you can see, our camouflage is particularly good if we're in vegetation. Not so good if we're out here on the snow. Copy. Uh, if leadership, uh, just quickly reminds me, if leadership all goes down, uh, let's not make this an hour to hour event in the first round. Uh, try not to double back for kilometres to try and find some way through the trees. It's sneaky. Just uh, organise what you've got with you, have someone suppress, someone move, bound across the open terrain like we teach in basic, and get on the objective as quickly as possible, or die, so we can start round two. Uh, someone had a question? Uh, yeah, in yeah. the event. Uh, go ahead, Catnip. Uh, you said that if there's going to be a high mortality rate, will that affect our hazard pay? Yes, if you die, you'll get double pay. <laughs> Next question. Okay. In the event of contact at Lima 12, I know it's so fresh out of Maine, are we going to maneuver? Like, what is our maneuver space as far as that? If we encounter contact there, it's going to be a, a, a small force. We're going to enjoy a over uh superiority when it comes to numbers. So um, whoever's closest to it, just light it up and the squads that are in the rear will maneuver and uh, take out those enemies. Three words. So that, uh, violence. That's a good point. Of action. Yeah, speed and violence there is a action hard... if we can of contact. Uh, we cannot cross the 1011 line. We cannot go north of that. Yes, thanks, Wilkram. Uh, also, uh, in terms of chain of command, if I die, uh, Rose is our 2 IC, and then we'll go in squad order. Uh, that'll be Raggy, Razia, Krusty, then Fulcrum. All right, uh, good luck, guys. Have fun. Squad leaders, break them out. We'll wait for life. And oh, we'll wait for life, guys. All right, and we are live. Did I see a message come through? Am I just blind? I don't know. We're just going to follow him. Actually, who should we follow? Who's going to be... Ooh, looks like squads 3, 2, and possibly 6 are going to be taking the direct route. We'll float around, I'll see who gets one. first contact. I mean, sure, the real life one could have been shitty, but at least they could have made the game, the uh, simulation version better. Who knows? I'm sure you do. I don't. I think it would have been hilarious if they uh, used that problem. old out of date <laughs> camo. My frames in the forest. Hey Breaker, do you want us to cut out more uh, more to the right of you? Uh, yeah, I mean, keep pushing north. Watch that space when you're fucking bunched at the moment. It's kind of tough at the moment. Right, guys, spread out our here. platoon was concentrated in there, so I get it. But, uh, let's work on it. Alright, so right now we've got a wall of Canadian forces moving northern and then once they get to their designated turning point they will start heading towards the objective to the west <laughs> yeah pretty much Mm. Frame rate is just not liking it when I move around. That is just horrible. Intersection's clear. Preparing to make a left hand turn to make approach to shipping center. Roger. If I can have all other squads uh, just get a uh, secure piece of back for four to uh, get another two, three. Looks like we've to got a crew with following. silent moving up. Got it. Possibly trying to scout out where the uh, calf forces might be pushing squad in. Squad six, when you're up to squad five, let uh, Rose know when you're set. Rose, that you'll then be good to move uh, north across the road. For those of you that are hard of seeing, the calf forces are currently living in the forest with the maple trees. As is normal for the Canadians, I hear that is their natural habitat. It's 
Oh yeah, it's a massive map, but we rarely use the full-sized maps for um, ops. And I'm not sure if that was a ND or what, because as far as I can tell, there is no one in view. Unless that was the... No, there's no way they could see him from here. Copy that, five. How's the FPS? Once you guys get into what they consider to be pretty good cover, can you get in the whole 3 uh, 16 so you can catch up? Uh, okay. They redid the graphics today. Check your spacing, boys. Wish they had implemented Vulcan or DirectX 12 into their uh, process. You know, I have a beefy CPU for a reason, and I would love to be able to use it on this game. It would definitely help with processing. Command is quite full. Yeah, go ahead, Paul. Uh, so I got eyes on shipping center. No visible contacts at this time. We'll report with any updates. Roger. Crusty, if possible, but depending on the train, can you get to approximately Juliet 11.5, those last few rocks on the map to your west by about 300 metres? And so you're looking at the north, northwestern side of the shipping centre. Hey, from. Yeah, it looks like they're probably going to have them go there. They do not use uh, markers so during the off. In, uh, uh, so you've got to get five, figure out what they're talking uh, about. We're going to get Razor set. There's going to be our two base of fire squads. And then we're going to have Raggy and Rose's squad move through them and uh, assault shipping. Fulcrum will be maintaining our northeastern security. Copy that. Oh boy, I'm regretting that coffee I drank today. Three to command. We are set, ready to be base fire. Roger, three. Yeah, no way the Russian forces are gonna be able to spot the calf until they either A, enter this forest zone, or they get right on the road here. Um... But I'm not going to put it past him. Silent has some pretty good sights on him. Hold at the top of the hill here. Um, less about that and more specifically is giving me a headache with this flat white landscape. It is bright as balls and my eyes are hurting. Alright guys, let's uh, get ready to light this uh, building up, it'll show a force, uh, whether we see the Russians there or not. So, uh, 4 and 3 when you're uh, ready, when 5 and 2 is ready. We've got a couple basic uh, trainings coming up, so uh, if you're center. looking at that, um, hop over to our squadups.gg website, sign up there, join our Discord, and uh, follow Three. the process of hooking up your Steam Russia. and your website account to your Discord. Which there are some walkthroughs in okay, the uh, Discord README yeah, section. Yeah, we, we just got my vision on shipping center. Roger. Once Rose is up moving, start getting the guys to uh, talk their guns onto uh, shipping center while maintaining 360 degree security there out to the west northwest. FM78 stuff. I'm sorry, some of this lingo just kind of goes straight over my head. Uh, Two is ready. Roger two. All right, three. You're good to open fire. Four. You're also good to open fire. That's been a while since I've taken basic, and I have no idea. Uh, our usual basics and whatnot consist up. of just Roger. teaching you the generals, and it looks like we have fire being tossed down on Silence Crew.
really just I'll just spread. I'm not sure if they actually spot them or if they're just shooting. Possibly they did spot them. There is no point for them to be shooting otherwise. Possible contact west. Uh, new. Um, really, there's no tactics. Hang on. Four is entering now. Roger five. Sounds like northwest. They've stopped since. Roger, Krusty, if you can just get your guys to shoot back uh, slowly in the general direction of that, I want to discourage them from moving until we have shipping yeah, It looks like Silence crew is going to move yeah, off. I have no idea where they came from. I just heard snaps from my head from the northwest. Yeah, Actually, it's, it's Oddball's crew. Near, um, uh, like India 11 2 ish, where that uh, bit of discoloration is on the map. I don't know what that's rocks or water or what it is. All right, so it's less of infantry tactics and whatnot with basic. That would be in our advanced course, which I don't even know if we hold those anymore. Um, SOT basic is just your general how we do things and what you should do, how you should do it. Yeah, there you go. Harb's got it. So squad four called contact to his uh, west northwest somewhere. Uh, must be probably three four hundred meters away. I want us to um, move on to that. So let's uh, get the platoon resorted. Krusty, I want you to start making progress to your west. Five and two, if you can just hold until Krusty gets out in front. Razor, I want you to follow four. Fulcrum, if you can start moving along the map border to your west. Or our movement border to your west. Copy that. Command, did you want five pushing up to wheel on fours west? Or you want me holding? Uh, just hold. want to give Krusty a bit of room uh, so we have room to maneuver this into contact. Copy that. Yeah, well, 750 hours is a plus, but uh, no matter how many hours, because we've got people who will join with probably more than that, who will still need to go through our basic, just because there are specific ways we run the uh, ops. That's really all basic is, is just gets you prepped on the same page with everyone else. Understood. Yeah, you guys on the uh, OP hub. Roger, let's make that our... Uh our target for you, Krusty, and for Raysha. Once you guys are forward about 100 meters, I'll give the order for two and five to start uh, moving west as well. You're good to start moving. Raggy, if you could hold until Rose gets uh, about 200 meters west. I want to have a uh, slanted line here moving, contact, moving to contact west. Contacted OP, contacted OP. Roger. Rose, start moving west. I don't want you letting whoever's there at uh, outpost Heb retreat back to the objective town in Gulf 12. Squads four and three. See if you can. Oh, uh, don't cry above average. Uh, Russians there. On They're our only first. average. That's fine. I'll get some kills for free. Three contact direct west, 150 meters. Uh, so computer wise, honestly, at this point with version two out, I couldn't even properly give you a proper estimate on what you would need to run the op. Um. We usually run them in tournament mode, which requires you to have certain levels of settings. Uh, looks like we've got contact between the Russian and the calf here, but nothing quite direct. Get you in here. Um, and price-wise, you can find it on Steam. I'm not sure if it's running 60 or if it's Harvey running 30. Harv, can you help me out here? Is it Roger. rolling uh, 60 bucks for uh, squad a, right uh, now? Push. Roger, three, you were able to put uh, a lot of suppression there to assist four. Did not hear that command. We're currently opening up an OPN. Roger, yeah, I'm asking you to suppress for four, so good work. Command be advised, five has encountered a very large 
uh, Cofield, we're wrapping around the edge of it. You guys. There's a little fob on the right. Frosty Bro, getting real close to the Russian forces here. Catch anyone returning off our post hip. Obviously, the rest of the team's going to be to your west somewhere as well. Make them approach in the head time now. All right, so to answer the, the money portion, uh, David Woods, it is 40 currently, I think. Can we have enemies crossing the road north of Outpost Head, likely in the woods H1178? H1178. Boy, we're about to start having multiple yeah, points crossing. of contact. Go ahead and try to take them out. And it looks like the Heading Russian forces top. are pulling back slightly into more defensible positions. Oh, Harv, I was asking uh, how much squad uh, cost currently on Steam. But I have prov been provided the uh, price by the Irish guy. You're able to hold once you get into a secure position, wait for two to catch up on your son's flank. Copy that, we're getting set up now. Go. Oh. And we've got close quarters over here. Command five is in close contact, we're mixed in. Mixed in with the enemy? Roger. Yeah, they're playing Bushwicky. Oh, Decker, I'm taken out by a nade. That's not good. Five, if you can uh, Copy that. retreat a bit, make some room so we can light them up. Ooh, super Spitfire is getting a little lucky there. Atomic, not so much. Getting knocked out by a nade. Looks like Crusty just went down. Roger. Uh, this is four. Crusty's down. Go ahead, JV, what's your uh, this is Canada versus is Russian. Um, unless your uh, question is particular to what top, clan versus top, what clan, yeah. this is not that type of event. Roger, where's the contact uh, that's messing you guys up? To your west, to your northwest, to your north? To our west. Oh, those Roger. frames. I have Roger. really got to slow down. I don't know if you can get around the south side of those rocks without being exposed to the town in Gulf 12, but that might be worth sending uh, a buddy pair this south of four. Where are guys? Yeah, I gotcha. Hey, bro, are you alive? Yeah, cool. And Command for squad smoke. 5. I'm giving you guys smoke. Get up there. Copy, southwest. Squad 5, report him when you can. Command, this is salty. I'm taking over for 5. Go to the situation up there, dude. We have contacts here at west. We have possible enemy contacts uh, within 20 meters and at the opposite ridge line from us. Roger, are you able to hold that position or do you need to uh, retreat? We're gonna put, we're gonna pull back. We're, we're pinned down. Roger. Braggy, can you give guys to suppress to their northwest, just to the west of five, so five can retreat? Yeah, copy that. Command to three and copy. six. We're gonna take their position right now. Oddball taking Roger, down kimchi and, and sunfish. Too hard to take. Sorry, good night. Band, I've got contacts H1115 just southwest of my uh, Bravo element. Hope you have is heavily fortified by these guys. Lots of bunkers up here, hard to assault. Roger, can you hold your ground there and just keep them entertained? Is that uh, a possibility? Will do. Alright, Fulcrum, I need you to back out to your southeast. Honestly, that is not a good position for Asia. On, uh, on the south side. Russian forces putting up a very nice defensive here. You're welcome, David Woods. Um, highly suggest joining our Discord if you have any other questions like that. Um, 
Once again, for the uh, PC specs for playing this, I really can't give a proper uh, suggestion. Say again, you cut out. If you could get your southern element to advance west, southwest as far as they can, we need to stretch the Russian line here. So, fill them out so we can find a way through it. Copy that. Taken down and entering just, uh, the central here. Grim Latron has uh, provided the dirty cover there. Looks like Razor, Twix, and Rather Sky's Chap alongside Ion have pushed up and pushed Oddball back a bit in the forest. Let's go over here and see who's getting ripped to shreds. Uh, looks like Raggy. Situated in Hotel 1316, southwest of your southwestern element. Thank you for the link there, Harv. Please note, all links can be uh, found for our Discord and our... Yeah, Discord. By typing an exclamation mark Discord in chat, it will provide you with a link to the uh, community Discord. I think it might be which is about website, possibly for the website. I can't remember. He's retreating to the west. Pushing Move off to your south southeast reposition. Super duper Rick might yeah, be able to see Floss McGruff's and Matt Honcho over here if he looks. Yeah, I want you uh, joining up with two. We're going to try and uh, punch it through here on the south side of the map. I and think it's, uh, looks like Matt Honcho and Floss McGruff's might get off smooth and easy. Let's pull back up here to We're the good. north and We're see what's going on. There we go, right squat right ups for the uh, website. And uh, start repositioning your guys to punch through down where squad 2 is. We'll try and make it into Gulf 13 8. Copy that. We're currently clearing out the woods south. Do you want us to disengage from that? Just leave a buddy pair so that they don't think that we've uh, moved. Uh, but moved, yeah. Copy. Salty, same for you. I want you. Um, Starting to uh, peel away and head down south. We're going to punch through with uh, squad two. Command, this is two uh, BAKs and possibly EKA three and Mikantas to our southwest. They pulled back. Excellent. Excellent. Good work. Let's uh, take up as much ground there. If you can start getting your guys to get aggressive there, Raggy. Maybe not your whole squad, but start uh, trying to get buddy pairs. I'm really interested in those rocks to your southwest. Copy that. You gotta watch out for them bush wookies. They are a killer during these ops. Salty. 
Sorry, Sorry contact Golf 1298. Squad 3 is still disengaging, moving southeast. Roger, does that look like where they're, they're concentrated? Golf 1298? Yeah, clearly the guy you're falling back from OB have, as well as those woods, trying to fall back into Fort Fed Town. Alright, Roger. A good job there taking down Chicken, but now he's in a very bad predicament of uh, being suppressed. Orientation of where the objective is. Objective is this town right here. Currently you have a wall of calf right here. And really not moving anywhere real fast. Uh, northernmost tip here is pretty much done with not exactly surviving first contact here with the Russian forces. All we've got left up here is one, two, three, four. Looks like four calf units still up here at the north. If you could have those guys up in the north just uh, firing intermittently so that the enemy doesn't realize that we're moving the whole platoon south. Capping that one. Yeah, it looks like the Russian forces are starting to push a bit out forward, trying to probe where they might be. Gordo over here might not make it back to his group. Depending on whether or not the Russian forces stare at him or not. He has a chance of getting away right now. But uh, looks like they're going to move in between them from, and his uh, friends, and it looks 37. like the three here in the forest are about to get pinched. That's west of you, the buildings. West of you, about three, four hundred meters. Squad two, report him when you can. I'm going to suppress the building blast. Roger. Her taken down, blind, taintless. Blind, 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 blind. Armady. Taken down and Wicks taken down. That's uh, pretty From much the all of the northern except for Gordo uh, over here. Town, uh, across the uh, bay west. Roger, you able to suppress them from where you are? How's the terrain look? Russian From forces have free uh, reign to just push down on the calf. Uh, oh. Down goes Dorf. Right, 
Not surviving first contact there. Could have taken the objective and just kind of dodging into a bush there. To our north, direct north, close, 50 meters. Alright, five minutes, turn that off. Fulcrum. Alright, you can fall back, we're gonna set up behind you. Yeah. Copy. Fulcrum, if you can get a buddy pair east of you, a couple of, about 100, 200 meters east of you. So if they rotate around five, you're in a position to pick them up. Three and two, we're gonna keep on pressing to the northwest. Copy that one. So, you know, I'll have to move off the back here and move back to the front. Looks like the Russian forces are about to get in some fights with the calf forward movement. Oh, how much I wish I could see the end of this fight back here. Mostly to see if Kerr will survive. Wait, is Kerr already dead? No, Kerr's back there. Okay. Go tell twelve five five enemy contacts. Roger. And it looks like the Russian forces might be pulling away from this rear fight, which means we have a chance to pull back over here to see this engagement. My friend Monty Python was a fantastic thing, and I have a great idea that uh, many thy holy grenades have been tossed during this op, and many have been fouled by them. Three is in car right, track, shooting two moving, story guys. red building, Roger. 100 meters to my west. I guess Luckily there are no town. foul bunny beasts Roger, uh, waiting Keep moving under fire. for the Canadians or the Russians. Just beyond these next to the rocks. Copy that. Alright, squad leaders are something. Try and uh, consider getting smokes out now. We need to cross this road. Gloves not sitting in a very good position, getting straight shot. If they can pull out of there. Lots of smoke going down, hopefully to help the, uh, what is left of the calf to pull into the objective. Six is engaged, six is engaged, Contact close. Contact 12, 5, 6. We're, we're new. In the town, looks like Nestle. Roger. Roger. Five and six, how goes it up there to the northeast? We're gonna pinch him here. Looking good. Looks like Fulcrum got knocked. Not sure why he was all the way over there. Command, those guys who are in the north uh, also have elements. Golf 12-5, locking down this eastern road. Usually a pinch requires you having another crew trying to attack from the direction. I'm not seeing another crew there, so I'm uh, in the assumption he meant flank. Uh, all right, two, let's we have to see to southwest as well. Sounds like two guns southwest. Uh, 
squad says command, by the way. Roger, six. Are you clear of contact there? Yeah, contact the building to west of one. Confirm yeah. building. Squad five there between us. Yeah, Roger. saving. Yeah, totally above average. Ran into him. Possibly killed one. Uh, Sergeant, how many do you think you're guys? One EK A6. And we're finally getting into close quarters combat here. Zavi is not done, and pen straight through the wall. Down goes Zavi. Three is now in CQB with these guys in the two-story red building. All right, Roger, three, good luck. We have contact squad two, we're taking well. fire from uh, closest buildings towards the west. One is down. All right, we're gonna fall back. Lawn, down. Lawn darts is gone. Let's see what is going on back here before they get too far into the CQB. Uh, oh. All right, did I say CQB? I mean CQC, close quarters combat. Uh, not looking good for the calf in the rear. I'm seeing one, two, three, four. Oop, I think that three calf left in the rear. So they will sooner or later get mopped up back there unless they get lucky. If they get lucky, we'll see them come up here. Not sure if this was a good position for the uh, calf forces to push right into the little also guys in that. sliver of Maybe forest here down. with a wall of buildings. The best position. Oh shit. Hey, that guy's still in that building. West across the road and some containers. You're really interested. Yeah, I, you shot me twice. I'm alive though. No, you, you're fine. This for you. You're fine. <laughs> oh, well, fuck you too. <laughs> hey, squad lead, that same building that you were shooting at you before. Good? Yeah, no. Copy. So this guy in this fucking building, we need to take him out, I feel like, because then we can push into this building and get an elevation advantage, right? Yeah, enough. yeah. I I'm about to check across the road. Copy, Sam. Ditto. He's like behind Watch this up. gray container, I think. I don't see him, but I hear those shots. I think he's behind the Toyota. Is he? I don't know. I don't That's where it sounds like Atlanta, so. Roger's got the right idea. He is behind the gray container. Oh, there he goes. No one's looking. See, it looks like a rear element has been pretty fucked. We need to push this town fast. Behind us somewhere. I've got your phone. We're thinking of going west. Uh, elements. Ion just not having good situational awareness here. I have an yeah, element trying to be rear security. They're in the tree and line another element us. pushing north parallel to you. We've got guys in the tree line behind us though, so it's a little bit rough. Gotcha. We'll be moving west and then uh, up north parallel with you. Alright, squad. We're going to go to both north and west. So on the road, we're going to move direct west uh, with buddy teams if you can form them. We're going to take that red building right there and then move up and re rally with three. Rick on me. We're going to be first. Alright, I'm, I'm with Coco. Coco, I'm still with you. Copy. Gotcha. Thanks, Mick. Heading west. Ready? On you. Alright, we're set. Alright, first pair, go. Going. Lake cover in the town. And we have lost the first buddy team trying to go in. Not enough cover fire coming from the secondary buddy team.
Remember, if you are uh, doing a buddy team step up, the team that's pushing should never stop and fire, should always push forward to its defensing point that it needs to get to. The team that is supposed to be providing cover fire needs to lay down as much shots in the direction of the enemy, or at least where they think the enemy is, to keep their heads down. Gotcha. As your best way of making sure that first buddy team survives to get to where they need to. Uh, then let's move. Oh, no, he's not. Okay. He just died. And down goes Ion. Well, now what? It came from like 285, one of these buildings. Yeah. No. I've never been in a command more, situation more, more before. Hard let's, uh, let's get over here about 20 meters west. I didn't see much fire coming from there directly. Uh, let's just make a dead sprint where did those red guys get? here to our 300. Yeah, where did, where did those guys get hit from that were... Uh... Everywhere, really, man. Uh, uh, they're all to the west but and to the northeast, but I don't think there are any directly northwest. I know that there are probably a bunch of people watching us on stream, and we're about to prove them wrong, but whatever. Let's just go for it. Uh, I'm going to set up cover if you... Yeah, Coco. Okay, three's, three's, push three's pushing south. Three's pushing south of us. Do you want to wait oh, wait, for them? I didn't or... even notice the rest of three was there. Yeah, I thought they were AFK or something. They're pushing from yeah, the south. Here. Right. Hey, what's your plan right now? They're in here. It looked like somebody, like an MG, was shooting from the north when those guys yep. crossed. At least yeah, if they no get across, we can maybe course. see where these guys are. Yeah, let's wait about 30 seconds, uh, see what they do, and then push across this road. I, I don't think we're going to make much headway to the west. Actually, uh, let's 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 form up on me. I think we can make it south across this road and link up with them. Because we have no, no inner squad comms. Not a bad choice getting down here on the, uh... We good? Yeah, I don't know. Lower. Yeah, I don't either. Oh, let's, let's I did bottom. not see Sergeant Jackson and Bartok. Is uh, Rager still in here? What? Here, I'm set up. I'm gonna cross. This is an yeah. odd pairing here. Oh no, Bartok, no! Run, Bartok, run! Oh, you are a lucky, lucky, lucky hat. Back. Of course they're watching this way. That's interesting, isn't it? What is going on back here? Why is there... Ah, uh, okay. Lone man. Last one of his team. He'll slowly get corralled forward. And it looks like while I went to go do that, Bartok has been perished. Can I get some sevens in chat for our fellow Bartok? Not particularly living very long and not getting to use his hat. Sergeant Jackson possibly going to attempt to provide some cover fire for the team moving up the river. Or ocean line. Shit, what's it called? Beach? No. Bank. Yeah, no. Wow, my mind is just not here. All right, who we got left? Oh, the man that was taking in charge is gone, so we are left with Coco Demir and uh, Shred Turtle. And it looks like Saber has relinked with the group. So, let's take stock on who we've got left for the uh, Cal... And not, wow, I was about to call it the California Armed Defenses. Okay, so, the uh, Canadian Armed Forces, we have Sabre, Shred Dirtle, Coco, and our resident op member, Sergeant Jackson. Can they do it? Give me your, uh... Give me your, uh... Predictions on what's going to happen. All right, we move now. Give us cover. Save us. Right, moving in. Ooh, Coco not quite making it. Shred Turtle making it in. Everyone misses Chicken. Chicken got knocked out at the beginning. Uh, Knocked out it's by good. a sneaky, sneaky though. Canadian. All right, if you want to try and bound up to me, I'm trying to uh, cover you. Moving. 
He needs to be careful poking his head in those windows. Oof. This house is... I'm in. Alright, we're gonna have to do the same, we're gonna have to do the same thing. You got ammo? We need to clear these buildings, kill the enemy. I have no ammo. I have no ammo, I'm afraid. I've got a yellow mag. Right, we can hear... There's Jackson. Right, northeast. Jackson is moving parallel with them. Okay, right. The son of a bitch is, uh... I think he's across the road in that, uh, building, uh... Yeah, we can hear you, Sergeant Jackson. Where is he? He is like a building in front of me to my northeast. He's got eyes on Steve-o. Well, I say relatively he's got eyes on Steve-o. Steve-o is pretty blending in with that little patch of grass there. And the snowfall is definitely not making that any easier. The one just north up. Sergeant Jackson. All right, I'll cover you. And Jackson moving up. Down goes Shredded Dirtle. Quite shredded, that is. Uh, that's All leaving right, well, Saber as the only one Push back him. there. Jackson pushing into the house. Oh, didn't quite survive the uh, contact with Matt Honcho here. And I tried to get in there to give you all a view on that a little too late. So we've only got Saber left. Can he be the uh, man of the hour and just win it all? Eh, I don't think the odds are pretty high for this one. Nope. Steve-O taking him out. Not a single pin on Steve-O though. All right. And if I'm not wrong, that should have been the last Canadian, and that should be GG. Yep, there it is. All right, we'll be right back for round two shortly. Hi, right, hey, welcome, welcome to Operation Enforcer Part One. Enforcer Part One, yes, thank you, Frost. Hi, right, hey, welcome to Operation Enforcer Part One. Today we are taking an objective at Gulf 12, Gulf 13 area. That city right there. Uh, I don't know the name for it. I don't care about this country, so yeah. Um, we're going to take in uh, that location, yep, on the fob mark. So what's going to happen today is we have one squad, uh, Paladin squad. Uh, they have an MMG and a couple ARs, and they are going to move along my uh, mark, my lines, my enemy lines, the red lines. They're going to move along these lines, going all the way around the enemy defenses, hitting around this location. You can't right? see your marks. And they're going to move into. What's up? I cannot see your marks. I can't. Right. I can. I can see. I can cap lock. Hits cap lock. Oh, okay. All right. Proceed. Oh, okay. Um, all along those marks, we're gonna get to a building here. This building, me or Silent discovered last round, is a giant ass tower that can literally oversee this whole village. Uh, I had two ARs set up in there while they were pushing from the south, engaging. So what we're going to do is, as the rest of the platoon sits and waits in this location, or around this location, we're going to wait for Paladin Squad to get into position. Once Paladin Squad's in position, I'm going to give them the go-ahead to start firing. Once we are ready to go, we are going to move from this location. We're going to move south along the coastline, and from the coastline into the village from the southeast. The whole point of this, guys, and I'm going to tell you right now, it's going to be not as exciting. We're not going to get into too much contact right off the bat. The whole point of this is to make them think that we took the whole truck around the uh, map to go west. That's what Paladin Squad's doing. The rest of the platoon is waiting in the east for Paladin Squad to get their eyes to turn west, and then we engage them from the east-southeast with a whole platoon. All right? So All that right. is the plan. 
Uh, tentatively, if there's any questions, go ahead and okay. ask them now so we can get this knocked out. So, Paladin taking one truck, or are they taking like multiple trucks? It look like we're taking the convoy over there. They're walking. We'll you guys see. are walking. We have oh, no uh, transportation oh. asset assets. Oh, okay. I thought you were just so, like I said, this is going to take a little while. It's going to take about, you know, 10 minutes, 10, 15 minutes for them to get all the way around. Because they're going to try and not get into contact at all. Period. No contact. So then, um, what happens if they get uh, killed beforehand? Then yeah. we improvise. Won't happen. It okay. won't happen. <laughs> we improvise all at right. that point, alright? I don't believe that, but okay. I Any mean, other questions? Won't happen, it won't. If there are I no other questions. Bridge. What's that? Any possibility of using that land bridge down south? Uh, if you want to get killed, yeah. Go ahead. Hey, command. Do we have to clear L12 and J12? It says in the dock we have to clear those. Nah, let's Is that right? Go. Oh, dude. I think so. I mean, I can go to L12 and clear that. Yeah, I mean, yeah, because that's, of the that's, fucking that's, dice that's, roll. That's too easy. Too that's rough, that's too. way okay. That's way too easy. Paladin squad will clear L12, really and then one single squad will go up and clear J12. Okay, I'll go clear J12. Very cool gun. Sounds good. All right. Uh, yeah. For All right. Fortune A just found something out nice. in the op doc. I was just corrected by the admin. We do have to clear out two areas: Juliet 12 Grid Square and Lima 12 Grid Square. All right. So Paladin Squad will clear out Lima 12 Grid Square, or correction, Lima 11 Grid Square, as on his route to the whole uh, flank that he's doing. And then Revy Squad will clear out Juliet 12 Grid Square as the rest of us wait in a platoon uh, OP down in the south. All right. If uh, Paladin goes wrong, like I said, we'll improvise. Most likely, we'll just do an attack from the and uh, get the round over with. All right. Cool. Squad leaders, go ahead and break them out. Admin message. I think. Hang on. Yeah, I'm not seeing it at all. Uh, does somebody have Duke Newbum? He is AFK currently. Uh-oh. He can catch up. Sounds good. Uh, for basically what I want you to do is literally get online in Lima 11 and clear it out. Uh, also, guys, prepare for a squad to be there. There wasn't a squad last round, so good possibility there's a squad this round. Just from reading up, Doc, it seems like they have to be there. I'm not 100% It's a that, dice though. roll. It's a dice roll, so it, it depends. I don't know. I don't think it is, though. It is. It's uh, if you get a one or a six, I need to amend get, something. Uh, a squad to spot I, uh, there. And if you get a one or a six, um, it depends. I think I misunderstood the operation doc slightly. Now that I'm putting two and two together with my coffee-addled brain, uh, the operation is called uh, Enforcer Part One, and I'm thinking. The Russian objective intel uh, portion that says clear. round one and round two, if round two uh, will be dependent on what happens in round one, I'm not sure if that's pertaining here, particularly because teams are flip. Um, so I don't know if that would have actually carried over. It doesn't really make a difference in this situation since round one... The Russian forces did successfully defend the position, which means they would still be back here defending this position. Anywho, back to our regular scheduled... Really, really interesting uh, operation here. Seeing where the Canadian forces will go this time. Four, did We're you looking clear at... out Lima 11? Four. Yes, clear. Just went through Lima Roger 11. That. Okay. So, we've got four moving northern, north, wow, northwestern, 
following the track one moving straight towards the position or up heb and uh, then we've got five two six and three moving along the southern border of the map uh, towards the objective in G 13 Slowly but surely, we are moving forward with the operation. We'll see how well the Canadian forces this time can get past this roadblock here. This one, we're about to start breaching the shipping center. This time around, it does not look like the Russian forces are going to push anyone forward to defend the shipping center, so there shouldn't be any... Difficulties getting past that it depends on how skittish the uh, Canadian command decides to be this round. And it looks like we may or may not have had a misconnection for Boogie uh, on the other team. So. That could be interesting. Wait, was that the other team or was that this team? Eh, I don't know. Let's go up here and see if there's any uh, local chatter. Sounds very, very, very quiet. Oh, what was that? Sound like vehicle. Oh, you know what? That's what that was. Vehicle spawn blow ups. Okay. Five, I want you to hold at the woods in India 1322, the ones you're just hitting now. Copy. Four, I don't know if you copied my last, but I said if you feel like that flank is not wide enough, go ahead and take it a little bit wider. Copy. Your whole goal is to not get caught at all, so. One, is that shipping center clear? We're clear. Roger, good copy one. That's if there's any local chat. I was floating around earlier trying to find some. One shipping center's clear. See, I don't well, here we Roger, are. copy one. Go ahead and hold your position there until we are uh, prepared to move. God, the airfield looks so cool. Well, like, I want to explore it, damn it, but we can't. <laughs> I mean, we can spend as much time as we want, right? Oh, yeah, that is true. No, they gotta wait on us. <laughs> no, I'm on limited <laughs> time right now, damn it. Stuff. Is this our hold position? We have an hour and a half, brother. This is our hold position. Four is actually about halfway there, I'll so... Uh, on that edge, this is gonna be fun. Remember, four so has no position. eyes on contact. Oh, yeah, they're, they're gonna, gonna circumvent the uh, Russian forces. Good. I, that's, that's a call you wanna... Uh, I, mean, I, I don't know if we wanna take that right away. 
Again, I want their eyes not looking at the east at all. Yeah, that's the thing. So we kind of have to be careful. So if you think that you can move up more, that's oh, fine. But I, I would, awesome. I wouldn't risk it. This is cool. It's very Canadian. For just remember that uh, we posted Revy Squad last match in the Foxtrot Ten Five area, and now those woods that are about to be south of you. So try to stay in the wood line if you can. Hey, so we're not allowed to be north of the 10-11 line, so we're now coming back. Oof, that's not good. Got it, got it, okay. So, oh, so those kinda, wondering what's uh, going on. Um, well, fuck. Um, so we roll these ops with a specific parameter on the working area for the operation. Uh, is not the full map, and usually they are limited to yeah, so only we, uh, the zone that is shown on back the back operation dock way. map. So we, can we are currently them, but we'll have to go through OP hub. a full yeah. grid square out of uh, the operation zone. So, yeah, go ahead and pull back to your rally point. And it looks like All right. the entire well, northern team is having to fully backtrack. Full east attack. Um, Dwarf, go ahead and lead us southeast into the southeast part of the village. We'll clear south to uh, north. Uh, three, okay. follow behind him. Two, follow behind. One, go ahead and break out a shipping container. Follow behind. Four, Ooh, I want man. you to pin down OP Hamp. Once you get back across the line. You got south covered, I've got north. I must have missed up. something here. Are we, we're still doing the same plan, we're just moving up a little bit, right? You, no, yeah, we're, well, we're not doing the same plan. Four can't go north of the uh, India 10-11, or the 10-11 uh, grid line. Oh, shit. That's so, we're right. having, okay. yeah, we're having them pull back right now. Uh, we're just completing the plan by having everybody push in currently from the south uh, east. And then we're going to clear the city south to east, or south to north. Too easy. Yeah, I can't see command, this is the two. Joke's round. The joke's Go for command. I actually just killed it. Do you want to, to advance directly northwest, or do you want us to follow the leader on five and three? Go ahead and advance directly west uh, if you want. It's, it's up to you. I want to try and keep all my forces in the same place, pushing on one singular position. So do you want four to come back down there with you guys? No, four. I want you engaging OP Hemp. Try to get their eyes north. Copy. Five. Is it possible you can get south around the whole village and ha have them not spot you? I mean, we're trying that now. Okay. I haven't seen anyone yet, so that's got me pretty nervous. I get you, uh, taking point. Yeah. As you say, uh -huh. you can like, demo it. Fuck. Four, once you are back across that, uh, 1011 <laughs> grid line, you are clear to, uh, you have freedom of maneuver by me to engage him. Okay. Copy. Remember spacing, guys. Turtle yeah, has most likely spotted the out. Canadian armed forces here. Hey, by the way, if I do Which go down, possibly it's going to happen. Secession of command is paladin. We could be Dwarf. seeing the Russian forces uh, readjust their Oswald. positions for this. And Frost. <laughs> ah, nice Midgard. Let's find out what is going on Contact here at the from north. Top of the refinery west. Yeah, they're, they're uh, watching the land bridge. Yeah, they're, they're on the uh, other side of the land bridge, looking at us on the rooftops. Across that land bridge down there. 
I can get my squad in position to engage him while they were. Never mind. Sure fucking looks like it. Yeah. Start. Get, stick to the tree. If you guys can get superior firepower and cross that land bridge, do it. Oh, good luck with that, but we'll try. That is a really horrible idea. If not, don't even worry Dwarf, about the land bridge. If you suppress Dorf, I'll push it. We can suppress, and if someone goes on the south side of the land bridge, you should be good. One, two, four, I need you guys to double time it. Five and three are engaged and you guys are so far back. Four in contact, four in contact. Roger, good copy, four. Take out that fucking uh, shit at OP him. Dwarf Roger had that fucking ARs on us. Watch the way you guys. Fucking yeah, yeah. Of us, guys. If you guys are all cl cl clumped over there, you're gonna make a fucking juicy target for the AR. Spread out. Coming back. Four, what's your contact looking like? Wait, what? what? Uh, we do not know yet. We just took fire when we were crossing. Roger, you're copy. Most likely a squad. One, I, I will come back to this in a second. Four. Let's go check out the Two, north. I want you to continue to help and assist five and three. Um, no, there's no more, no more need to come down here. Roger, good copy. Two, assist one and four then. Five and three will work together to get across. Unless two and one, you guys can continue this push east, then continue that push east. Correct, west. west. Sorry, my bad. West. Four, this is one. I need to know where you're being Contact. shot from so I can reinforce. Squad 5, contact northeast, close on the rocks. Cut. Are you sure? Looks like we've got the land. Oh, down goes yeah. Fluffs on the land bridge. Right Push the land bridge. Alright, don't get yourself killed, 3. I want land on it. It's not looking good. Yeah, Frost. I see anymore. Oh, down goes Frost. We lost three. Right, this is four. a plan of desperation. I can already tell. Uh, be advised, we have we four has contact behind us in the northeast. Roger, four. I need you to continue putting pressure on the north. Of the city. Don't worry about the contacts behind you. Yeah, you got Go Bartok ahead. on your rear. That's the. Let's that's never good. Into the city, take the city, and then we'll worry about the contact on the outside. On Three, the upside, they are definitely that's pushing that compound very well. Though so then again, the looks like the Russians don't really want to hold it, down. so they're just slowly pulling out. Three. This is command. How do you copy? Uptown, this is command. I'm not even sure if they have command comms at this point. Probably does, it just doesn't know how to use it. Five, I may need you to go and grab three. Why? I got they're a cross here, no problem. Up. Yeah, they're not responding to my command or anything. Uptown, respond on comms. This is currently on version two of squad. It's G, Uptown. Press G. Oh, that's never good. Uptown, this is Command, do you copy? Combat Slot, this is Steve-O, Squad Steve 3. Steve-O, hello, yes. Awesome, this thank is you, a no three. go. The land bridge yes, is a yes. no-go. Tra tracking all, break your squad off and follow five in. Copy that. There's follow in over here. I'm not moving... Three, move north of your position. Where five's at. 
I've got the better spot of like four ARs on me right now. Four sure. golf twelve ninety. Careful, we have guys there. Golf twelve ninety. Let's move up the line here. Canadian forces are stalled in the south. Canadian forces falling down in the north. And we are making no progress like round one. Four, continue that pressure on the north. I need you to get into the village. Copy, working on it. Roger. Go ahead and do so. This is three. We're we're fucking. We're trying to pull back. Hang on. Roger. Three. If you get to my, if you get to the rocks, I'm leaving. It'll probably be a little bit better off for you. And this like could be bad wrong. for the Canadian forces here in the north. Okay, well, if they're I mean, not careful, they could get pinched. Double check, but... Does look like the Canadian forces down in the south are making a little headway towards the this objective. Roger, but once again, three. slowed down. Remember, we you guys got smokes. Pop smokes if you need to. I don't know if Smokes is going to help you at this point. Two, I need you to push and close the gap between one and five. Understood. Pushing and closing the gap. Three, I want you to leapfrog with five. Go ahead and push past it's five as far as... best... Everyone's best... The best way to get in is either come in the way I'm at now, or to go rest west of one, directly west of one. Command, this is squad three. We are low on ammunition. Like, oh, very low on ammunition. Good. Roger, you copy three. Just go ahead and push him with five. Reinforce five, three. That's what I want. Hey, break, break, command. We are smoking the road. We think we can get into the village. Roger, good copy four. One. I need you to start smoking and make them think that you're also going to push. Uh, we're actually going to push. That's fine. Do that too. Oh, let's go. Yeah, it looks like we're about to have a Canadian push, push in. into the objective. Let's not push him one at a time. There I'll they go. Your, uh, squad with uh, three and five. We go with one. They're stacked up already. All right. Well, one's already going. So. Okay. I'm just. We have contacts north of one close. Roger. You copy. They're engaging four. Good shit. Five and three. Let's get this place cleared out. All right. I'm alive on the other side of this road, but. Fucking yeah. Try to get your head. <laughs> God damn it. There's no way that's gonna, I'm gonna get anybody else across. Roger, good copy. Anybody got ammo? Anybody got ammo? Five and three are in the south. We need, we just need to start pushing in and clearing out the, these buildings. Oh, it's not looking good for the northern crew here. Down goes the nightmare to ion. I on. think that we're still coming from north. Ion needs to be careful. Ooh, almost got him. Dobbs just They're barely making it. He needs to. Roger. 
Bandage. My entire Sunfish squad. may come in and clean him up. That's okay. That's all right. Boogie's we're, squad we're is in shambles at this point. I was hoping the and plan would down work, goes Doc. Can't cross that uh, grid line. So yeah, good job. And I'm uh, I'm gonna call out for that yeah, northern squad. Well. They are gone. I honor your sacrifice. Looks like the rest of the Russian forces are moving in on them. Kerr's group here has successfully pushed into the lower portion of the town. Uh, and we've got a large calf crew here, not Hold even position. in One, the town two, yet. I need you guys to get across this road so we can start I'm clearing it out. Student. We're smoking and getting lots in buildings. Oh, this is going to be a bloodbath. Almost made it. Audible not running in quite the right direction. No, I guess he wants to go down here where the other squad is. That looks like we've got two, three, four. Canadians have made it sort of in the town. We lost one of the guys on the cross, we're on the village. Her is slowly bleeding units. Oddball is now on the tree line behind Kerr. Command, There's a the tight a, a bunch of Russian forces there. Uh, OP is at Gulf 1387. Oddball, the only one who pushed in. Not sure if that was intentional or not. They're in that big. Uh, Guys in the big brown building. So what are you looking at? And I'm looking at the brown building 222. Oddball's crew has moved in with him. Good, good. Let's check on what's going over here. Yeah, it looks like the Canadian forces have made a nice little foothold here in the uh, northern section. Back down here to the south. First crew is now on their own. Some lima bean in there, so they'll be fine. Golf thirteen eight seven guys, let's move in. Shit, we lost game. We lost this so ah, goddamn. You wanna? And we are just losing command left and right for each squad. This is still not stacking up very good for the uh, Canadian forces here. Hola, Maria. Squad lead, we're at. Push past me, push past me. Our squad is dead. To where, to where, to where, to where? you? Yellow house. So is Boogie, apparently. Okay. Interesting. Alright, everybody here is dead. Polish, heal up if you can, brother. I'm healing. Okay, we're supposed to push south from here. Squad 2 looks like they're coming up to us on the map, so let's hold here for a second. Where the hell is everybody dying? Uh, Where are you getting shot from? No idea. No callouts. I got hit twice. Yeah. That's to our northwest. Yep. Yep, northwest. Good. Good, Duke. Good. Provide yourself as the target and give your uh, enemies something to this. shoot at. I got eyes on. Green building. Looks like one guy in a window. He's not peeking out far enough for me to shoot him. I can shoot that way. <laughs> I'm gonna try to reach around here. I'm hit. I'm hit from the southwest. That yellow building. And down goes Captain Morgan. To I am assuming that was Krusty. 
with a nice little peek there. I got contact here. This brown building. Shit. Who's with? Duke Newbum and uh, right. Holish are the only uh, two here in the building. north. I don't know if he's dead or not. Oh, I take that back. Two plus two more in the rear. Nope. Three more in the rear here. We've now two more. Yeah. Silent and uh, Alzadi. And I take that back. Duke Newbum and uh, Polish have just been taken out by an aide. My holy hand grenade has uh, been tossed. Again, enemy northwest around building 100 meters. He's peeking a window. I think I didn't get him. Uh, hold on, I got a lot here. I can use that. Uh, just which window? Sorry. I'm shooting at him. Okay. A lot out. Trying to take out lawn oh, darts. Window, that little one, that little square one. Yep, yep. We still got FTL up. Oh yeah, this is not an easy op, especially for the assaulting force. This town is a nightmare for CQB, CQC. Watching this alleyway. Oh, I gotta move anyways. Fuck it. Yeah, just go. This side's clear. Yeah, just peek the front side of my building, and I'll push out and help. I don't see. Here, I'll be able to heal you. I think you're gonna move. He's still alive. Taking shots safe, taking shots safe. Oh no. Oh, I'm here. Tommy getting safe hit. West, safe west, safe west. I think that's Viper pinning him. Whoa! They can penetrate the walls or what? Yeah, yeah just, just stay down, stay down, stay down. Yeah, his pin damage is a thing. And you are in a flimsy wood house. Oh, Alzadi not doing so good over here. Running around in the open. Giving Sergeant Jackson Scottish a uh, moving target to shoot at. Better than a sitting target, though. And we have just lost the last of Kerr's group here. And we've got Lagar. What are you doing, Lagar? What are you doing? You're a lat. No, you're a... Yeah, a lat. Hanging out in the southern forest. Down goes the Zaudi. Uh, who got him? Was that Krusty again? Krusty, you are dirty. Stop shooting enemies. Stop being a peeking little person. Stop it. I have no idea where I was going with that. My mind has just kind of gone in stupid mode. All right, so all we've got left up here in the north is silent, and down here in the south we've got Big Rago, Xcron, Atomic, and Lagar. Wait, is he still alive, or is he just dead on the ground? He is dead on the ground. So we've got five Canadian forces left, up and roaming. is not anything the Russians have to do. They All they have to do is sit in position. It is the uh, Canadian forces that have to do something. And right now, they pretty much got them locked.
Silent trying to defend himself up there in the north. Looks like uh, Razor and Sergeant Jackson alongside Scott's Chap are finally pushing in. I do believe they are fully aware that he is in this little brown building. Silent taken down by... I'm not sure if that was Scottish or if that was Jackson. I think that was Jackson. Alright, that's leaving us with the south now. Lagar's still up. We've got Xcron, Big Rago, and... That is it. Oh, no, there's Atomic. Atomic may not live very long. Shred Turtle got him. Atomic is down. Fuck, there's one blast. Xcron freaking out. Probably should get inside the building instead of sitting out in the open on the uh, back side of it. But that is just my view on things. Lagar somehow made it into God, town. He needs to be very careful about this window. He's got two very oh. sharp-eyed individuals. And down goes Lagar. I think that was Viper that got him. Straight through the forward window here. And down goes Xcron. Okay, well, I think... Waiting for the... Uh... Bullets of Salute, there they are. All right. That is round two of Operation Enforcer Part One. Mission accomplished.